Good morning, I'm Dharma, and this is a message for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Cross Watchers, and anyone who was called to this message. There's going to be an extended for this. The link for that is in the box below. It'll take you to Vimeo, or you can join the membership side of this channel. And also, information for private readings is in the box below. And my readings, as far as timing goes, tend to last from reading to reading. So this is the Tarot of Mystical Moments combined with the Moon deck. All right, what do we have for Sagittarius, please? The first card that came out when I started shuffling before I turned the camera on is I am ready. Thank you. This is someone surrendering, someone ready to embrace anything that the moon is, the moon spirit, universe, whatever, the energy at hand is trying to send your way. Someone may put it out there, okay, I'm going to surrender and just see what this is. And then they just let go to the tower. Let go and then cling on. Yikes. It, something might get real, real fast. Judgment and the Two of Pentacles. Something might get really real, really fast. It may have been that someone has been putting it out there and putting it out there to the universe or however you manifest that they want something, a deep commitment perhaps, if we're talking about love here, it could be a job, anything. But it is... The... <coughs> You're, it's like they, it, it's like it took so long, maybe even like 20 months or two series of twos, right? Two years even. There's, you got two balls juggling. These are two like energies that are trying to get matched together. And it's like, and I, that's why I keep saying stuff's getting really real, really fast. You may have to start making some quick decisions. You might have to, it's like you ask the universe to give it to you and you're getting it. The Phoenix. That's judgment twice. But it's also destruction and creation. And with the two of pentacles being here, you may have asked for something specific while you still had something else. And it's like, okay, you're going to get what you wanted, except you have to let go of the other things. And when that starts to happen, it looks like someone like reaches on, like reaches, like don't, but with the elephant here, I'm seeing the word trust, like trust that there's another like-minded person around you even if you can't see it just trust and whatever this is that's trying to fall let it fall because something here is coming in like whatever this is that is coming in is so loud and so it's exactly what you asked for so it's like surrender and let it happen because it's here it is just relax and the light those two came out together this tower moment this big loud um sh earth shattering moment that changes everything you may have been able to feel it coming like you know how with elephants okay if there's a herd of elephants you can hear them coming long before you actually see them and that spiritually speaking that might be relevant that you could feel this big change was coming and this thing was starting to erupt but whatever this is it's this big loud all the lights get turned on every it's loud and that is supposed to be you know an archangel or some kind of <coughs> all defining <coughs> Uh, the arrival, the stork, right? It's here it is. Right here and right now. 
and this is like just respond with grace and poise she's got on this like fancy outfit and we were, we're always talking about corsets and you know responding with grace and poise even if you want to slap a hoe right but this is the, I don't feel like this is even that so here's your one chance fancy don't let me down When I saw the tree too, I'm noticing that it says past lives. There's like, so this is spiritual. It's a big, huge realization between two people that something is as you thought it was. There could be like deep eye contact, I guess, but there is, it's the Ace of Pentacles. That's exactly my point. This offer and the emperor, they're coming in like here. I've had the aha moment. You have a new, there's a new sheriff in town. I mean, whoever this is, this particular emperor, I heard your emperor. They are ready. And so are you. There was just something about that may have been why I was saying it, it took a long time to manifest it or a long time to ask for it. And you were just kind of going with emotions at this point. Like, yes, yes, yes. I still have the same manifestation. I'm still wanting the same uh, person. I'm still wanting all of the things. Yep, yep, yep. And then it like comes in and you're like, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Because it's like coming in really fast all of a sudden. Zero to 60, which I mean, I, I, it feels like we're grateful for this because it's, it's like exactly why I'm ready. Thank you. Thank you to the universe. Yes, yes. You may hold it like you may be, you may cling on to this emperor and say thank you. Like, I'm so glad you're here. I'm so glad I found you. I'm so glad to see you. I'm just, it's big, it's loud, it's huge energy that blows everything else out of the way. It's like you don't have a choice but to surrender at this point because it's gonna take you with it. Judgment again. And she's like, yeah! Hands up, I'm, I'm ready, thank you. Just over and over again. Because that I, I'm ready, thank you. Let me write that down because, whoa. Let's talk about what this is. I mean, I, I'm going around and around and around. It's the entry of this person. That is, it's turning on all the light bulbs. It's, it's the realignment. It's earth shattering, but here it is again with the eight of wands, zero to 60. Like they, <laughs> whoa, I, it feels really like, can we, is it possible to just, this person, look at this, with ecstasis, they are, it's, a, it's just, it's with this here too, see how this tower is, it's like a volcano. And it might start to, it might freak you out a little bit because the energy is so big and so real. And so it's just, it's, it's, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Fucking Romeo, like there, I, uh, it feel, why does, why do I feel so nervous about this? Because you guys, if you watch me regularly, you know, I don't usually have a problem like stumbling over words. This person might make you nervous because it's almost like, what do you do when you finally get what you want? Main female. You're the main female. And you're my main. <laughs> Which 
the fuck is that supposed to mean? You're my main, like you're the main one in my life. If I had a, if I have to pick one, I'm picking you. And I also want to say the time of not seeing them regularly, regularly is over. And you're okay. All right. So let's talk about some actions here because look at, I'm just sitting there like, here you go. You can have it. I want to first ask like, why, why now? Or does it matter? They spent a lot of time, I was going to say indecision, but indec indecision. That's why. Why now? Because they couldn't decide before, and then they do. But they don't just decide. They come in like a wrecking ball and just like sit down on the throne. They're like, okay. <laughs> Daddy's home. I'm here. Tell me about judgment and why and what it, it is behind this. That's because the, the judgment card three times. You said, I'm ready. Thank you. And the universe said, okay. This might happen. You might be asleep. Happiness wakes you up. In the Ace of Cups. Um, <laughs> what's happening? Exactly. It's a, it feels, it feels, I don't want to say it feels too good to be true. Because it, that is what it feels like. But the other thing is like, you see that you're the main male. Female. Main female. You're they you are the one that's always on their mind. You're the one that they always come back to. Look at this. And I just split the deck. And it's the king and queen of rods with the three of cups. This person's always gonna come back around, no matter what, even if it takes a while. It's like in one way or another, this judgment moment is they are expressing to you that you're their counterpart and they know it. The sun, and that is like a that's a happy thought for them. They're pleased with this information or this realization that they're having. But the judgment is they the judgment moment, the big change is they like appear in your life as a regular thing. I'm surprised the death card didn't come out because that's kind of the same vibe where when you have the death card, it's you don't go back. It's like if, if you if this is someone new, it's you don't go back ever to the time before you knew this person. Like once you meet someone, that's a death because they're then changed. You're changed. You the death is that you now know this person. But I heard more intimately the Empress. Oh my goodness. I heard crowning each other. And then I heard permanent decision. The devil. You two might get really, really, really obsessed with each other. And that might be why it's this. Like you can't get enough. It almost feels, it almost makes you feel like um, sick to your stomach when they're gone. Like your body and your soul and all of this craves this person. And it's like it's never worn off. That's not a feeling that's ever worn off. If you've, if you've known this person, it's not, it's not new. And it's still as intense as it always has been. And so, and so they come forward. I mean, it's, it's the, they, here it is. It's like they turn the light bulb on. You've been sitting in the dark for however long and blink, here they are. It's you. It's always been you. It's always going to be you. No matter what, you're my main squeeze. And you're like, I'm in. Okay. But let's, I mean, the devil is right there. 
and that uh, it this could go very like toxic very very fast but it's ace of pentacles again here take on me take my hand take me home <laughs> I'm not gonna hit that high note but I know all you did okay in your head it's there they are so what do you so it feels like we're just standing there looking at each other and it just feels like they come in you're my lady I'm your man and then you Guys, sit down and hang out and watch TV. And just, you're okay with, I'm okay with this. So, but this part here, with this clinging to this tower, it's very, very, I still don't feel 100% that everything is going to be hunky-dory. And that might be from past experiences, and we'll get into that in the extended. But this judgment moment... It's like, they, you said, I'm ready, thank you, and the universe said, okay. Now what are you going to do with it? All right, so let's go find out. The link for the extended is in the box below, or you can join the membership side of this channel. And if this is your story and you want more details, links for um, private readings are at my website, dharmajane.com. Until next time, have a good one.